guys, it's Diamond Craft and Stream. Today, I'm going to show you how to download the Clay Soldier mods. So, what you're going to want to do first, uh, well, to show you, I'm starting from scratch. I'm going to open Minecraft. You should also do that. Force the update. So, log in. Oops, sorry. Log in. Click on Force Update. Done. And now you want to log in. And it's going to download all the. Uh, the Minecraft files. Okay. So once you get to this screen, that means it's done downloading. You can close it. You need to close your Minecraft or it's gonna bug. Then you want to open Safari or your internet browser and download. Go to D3 iFly page. And so how you're gonna have to wait five seconds, as here, uh, shown here. Do not click on any of the ads. Wait five seconds. Up here at the top. Click skip ad and it's gonna start downloading. All these three links, download them. It's gonna bring this one's gonna bring you to a media fire link. You also download and here also click skip ad skip ad, it's gonna download automatically. Now you may close all these. Just close your Safari, your internet browser. And now these files, uh, you um, it would be better just to drag them onto your desktop so you can easily find them. So basically, there are three files, and for some reason, I have Minecraft Forge twice, so it's just going to be named Minecraft Forge Universal 1. So you have these three files right here, these three files downloaded. So once you have put them on the desktop, you can go into Finder, click on here up top, go, go to Folder, and type in exactly this without the bin. Type in this and click go, so it's going to bring you to your Minecraft folder. Click inside your bin. Open Minecraft.jar, uh, I mean rename Minecraft.jar to Minecraft.jar.zip. Click enter, click use zip. Now double click it to extract it or expand it. And this Minecraft.jar.zip, delete it. You should have a Minecraft.jar folder. Now you want to open Minecraft.jar folder. Uh, for some reason, you can't search up here. You need to find it manually. So find meta-inf, which is... Um, about here. Okay, right here. So this folder right here, you need to drag it into your uh, trash or just right-click on it and click on Move to Trash. Okay, once you have done that, it's really important, otherwise it's going to black screen. So once you have done that, open this Minecraft Universe, uh, Minecraft Forge Universal folder. Double click on it to open it. And all these files in it, just click Command A or just select them all. So I'm going to click Command A. And you want to drag them into your Minecraft.jar folder. Drag them in. Click Apply to All, Replace. And once everything's inside your Minecraft.jar folder, you can close this and delete this folder. Now you want to make to make sure nothing's bugging and you have done everything well. Open your Minecraft, log in, and you should get this little downloading thing, which means it's correctly downloaded. And so now your Minecraft is a bit different. You have mods right here and this stuff. So you can close your Minecraft again. And here you should have new folders in your Minecraft folder, you should have new folders. So if you close this, just go to uh, go to folder and type this again and click go and you'll get here. Um, so once you have done that, uh, open your mods folder. So your Minecraft, click mods, the mods folder that has been added to your Minecraft when you opened it. So click in it. If it's not here, just create a new folder named mods no capital letters, just exactly like this. And these two files here, the placeholder and the manager pack, the jar files, you want to drag them into your mods folder. Now you can close this and open your Minecraft. Log in. Okay, log in. So now if you go into mods, you should have these two mods added. And you need to make sure it's completely downloaded. 
uh, you can just create a new world. I'm going to go into creative, create the world, and then let's wait, like, create the world. Okay, now just open your inventory and okay, excuse me, and now click this little arrow right here that goes to second page and click this clay soldier's item thingy. Click it, and here you should have every thing from the clay soldier mod. So, for instance, I'm going to take this and just place one. And I've got clay soldiers. So, thanks for watching. Hope it helped you. And bye.